Baby, be in love with your fantasies I can be a star, make a sky so bright Welcome to my dungeon, this is ecstasy Let me play the fantasy What's good, YouTube? It's your girl, Asia And it's your boy, BJ Back in the building Back in the fact Back, back like we never, never left. left. Y'all, we back in the building, ready to go, copacetic, man. Yeah. Just, just getting my energy, energizer vibes on right <laughs> now. And we got a really good one because we having a lot of fun with this South Park. I know I am. Yeah. But, you know, this is like my first uh... time like really like venturing into um, like South Park. And we got a really good one because one of our law supporters, Cali by Yukon, actually put together a video. Yeah, shout out to Cali. For real, for real, for real. He like, look, I'm gonna put y'all on to to Canadian <laughs> South Park people, okay? Yeah, man. <laughs> I'm trying to tell you so, man. Major, major love. Uh, so we're gonna be checking out South Park best of beady eyed Canadians. Yeah. <laughs> I'm excited think? to see this. Yeah. No, because when he started explaining to me like what the Canadian, um. Characters look like on South Park. Gotcha. I was just like, no, that's who they are. And what's crazy, like if you if you remember, we saw on the very last, like at the end of the last South Park video that we did, that there was, um, there was like a a little character that came Towards at the, the very end. end. Right, right, right. And I was yep. like, oh, that's mm -hmm. perfect. <laughs> I remember that. So I remember that. This was like right on time. So shout out to Callie. Thank you so much, Callie, for putting this together mm -hmm. for us. Absolutely. Uh, it is definitely, definitely appreciated. Um, so, yeah. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, in? hit the notification bell, and let's jump into this video, y'all. All right, let's jump into it. Yeah. Okay, you ready? Here we go. All right. <laughs> Hello, young people, and welcome to the most fascinating time of your life. You have braved the trials of childhood, and now you are reaching Canadian puberty. By now, you've probably noticed some changes in your body. For instance, when you fart, your dick gets hard. <laughs> what? Hold on, what? Okay, okay. What? Uh, okay, but we might have noticed some changes. Bro, I don't know. <laughs> no, sir. For instance, no. when you fart, your dick gets hard. <laughs> When you fart? <laughs> Other physical I'm changes not. are happening to your body as well. If you're a boy, you may notice that your testicles ache. Or if you're a girl, you may notice a tingling sensation in your strange. Going through Canadian puberty, you may notice that your voice is starting to change as well. You're saying things like, hey buddy, and hey guy. Because now that you're older, you're discovering that someone who was once your buddy is now your guy. And someone who you used to call guy is quickly becoming your friend. <laughs> but now let's discuss how a man and a woman make love. First, a man and a woman fall in love. Then, the man farts on the woman's strange. <laughs> filling the woman's strange with air so that the woman can quit in the man's bed. And a baby is born. The entire what? process can take up to six months. At... It's what? That's not how a baby is born? <laughs> Let's see. Well, might... <laughs> That's not like some kinky <laughs> sex game that he's talking about right there. <laughs> And then the air goes up and what though? No. And then the baby comes out? That is crazy. Are <sighs> oh, they serious though? So. What semen? Well then why did my wife creep in my face? She said it was to Oh then why would I'm gonna get to the bottom of this? <laughs> <laughs> oh, why did my what wife candy, Cartman? Oh, let's see. Uh nope, I don't have any Jewish candy. Why'd you really need all that chocolate, fat boy? Ba -ba -ba -ba. Shh, the movie's starting. What did the Spanish priest say to the Iranian gynecologist? I don't know, Philip. What? <laughs> Where do they come up with this stuff? You're such a pig fucker, Philip. <gasps> what did he say? Terence, why would you call me a pig fucker? Well, let's see. First of all, you fuck pigs. <coughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> well, fuck my ass and call me a bitch. <laughs> you shit faced cockmaster. Wow. Shit faced cockmaster. Listen, you donkey raping shit eater. Donkey raping shit eater. Don't be baby. She did her. Oh, oh, the baby even said it. it. Oh, oh my gosh. Baby. Yes. Yo, not the baby. Donkey raping 
shitty. Snoopy baby, she did her. You'd fuck your uncle. You'd fuck your uncle. Shut your fucking face, Uncle Fucker. You're a cock-sucking, ass-licking Uncle Fucker. You're an Uncle Fucker, yes, it's true. Nobody fucks uncles quite like you. Shut your fucking face, Uncle Fucker. You're the one that fucked your uncle, Uncle Fucker. You don't eat no sleep or mow the lawn. You fuck your leader. uncle all day long. <laughs> how they all were leaving they all were walking Everybody out like the oh theater. what do you expect from Canadians y'all they That's were out crazy. out okay really oh yeah. oh suck my balls we must stop dirty language from getting to our children's ears we must go fight the source of it but what is the source oh that's easy times have changed our kids are getting worse they won't obey their parents they just want to fight and curse should we blame the government or blame society or should we blame the images on tv no blame canada <laughs> With the beady eyes eye. and the flapping heads. That's what she said. Insults left or right. Come on! <laughs> They're not even a real country anyway. <laughs> My son could be a doctor or a lawyer, rich and true. He's saying he burned a black of piggy on a barbecue. Should we blame the matches? Should we blame the fire? Or the doctors who allowed him to expire? Heck no! Blame Canada! Blame Canada! With all the hockey home of the moon. And that bitch on Murray too. <laughs> oh. They blame it Canada. Mom, <laughs> mom's against Canada. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Canada deserves more money. One, two, three, four. Canada deserves more money. Look, buddy, me and Philip need to go home for a bit. Go home? You can't leave the picket line. But this is taking too long and Philip is diabetic. Look, guy, we have to stay strong. If you don't stand with your fellow Canadians, then you are a rat! Don't call me a rat, buddy! I'm not your buddy, friend! He's not your friend, guy! I'm not your guy, buddy! He's not your buddy, friend! I'm not your friend, guy! Yeah, let's give it up, guy! Don't call me your guy! I am not your guy, friend! I'm not your friend, buddy! I'm not your buddy, guy! <laughs> hey! What do you think you're doing? Get him out of here! Drift, idiot. Maybe you can go live with the Danish. You'll regret this day, friend. I'm not your friend, buddy. I'm not your buddy, guy. He's not your guy, friend. <laughs> I'm not your friend, buddy. 
I'm not your buddies, gay. That's, that's <laughs> not your, I'm not your gay, buddy. I'm not your buddies, gay. That sound like the like the like like the like the Canadian thing. Yeah, probably gay. Yeah. Gay. I'm not your I'm not your friend, buddy. I'm, I'm not, not your, your buddy, buddy gay. <laughs> Did you see that? They arrested Terrence and Philip. As the Canadian ambassador, I hereby condemn the actions taken by America in apprehending Tans and Phillips. As you can see from this graph, the entire economy of Canada relies on Tans and Phillips. Without them, we are doomed to recession. What say you, Mr. American ambassador? Fuck Canada! Uh, fuck you, buddy! Terrence and Phillips will not be released. They are going to be put on trial for corrupting America's youth. We don't know what all the fuss is about. The fuss is about taking our citizens. It's about not censoring our art. It's about... It's about... What's so goddamn... Look at them laughing. <laughs> no, nothing, nothing. Uh, could you tell us again what your argument is all about? <laughs> <laughs> this is about diplomacy. This is about dignity. This is about respect. This is about realizing that humor is... <laughs> you guys are dick. Release Tans and Philip, or we'll give you something to cry about. <laughs> <laughs> they are not right. They, 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 they're not taking Canada seriously. No, not at all. Oh, they like, like okay. man, what are y'all really gonna do? Okay, now see, now you got mamas against can they, uh, Canada. Now you got yeah. you got the whole government. Uh, <laughs> they done shipped off some people who because of Terrence and Phillip. That yeah, c yeah, because of Terrence and Phillip. C corrupting the youth. Now I tell you, boy. Look, they ain't taking them serious at all. Oh, and here she comes. Yes, there Canada she is. Canada Air Force. The about to be princess of Canada. Isn't she ravishing, so pure of heart, so strong in body, so hot in the face? She is indeed the living symbol of our great country. My God, she's beautiful. Princess, princess. Canadian prince now dipping his arms into the pudding, as is tradition. Princess will, of course, scrape the pudding off the princess's arms, thus symbolizing their union. What a glorious day for our country and indeed the world. And now, of course, the, wait a minute, what's this? Oh, uh-oh, something is going terribly wrong. The abbey is shaking violently as explosions abound. The top, yes, the top of the abbey is collapsing. The prince and the princess look on in horror. This is not the tradition. This is not tradition at all. This is not tradition. Giant hole now blasted into the ceiling. Debris falling down and crushing several spectators. Which is also not the tradition for a royal Canadian wedding. Bright beam of light shooting through the hole in the ceiling. The princess now in some kind of isometric cube. Who the that narrated this right here? <laughs> I did not know. Uh, it's almost like that. It's like he's going live and he narrating everything happening. <laughs> Bricks falling on top of it, spectators' heads. Somebody just died. Great. <laughs> in the ceiling. The princess now in some kind of isometric cube. This is certainly breaking with tradition now. <laughs> no. No. Canadians in attendance cannot believe their eyes. Widespread panic. The princess being hoisted away. The little mushroom oh. people of Nova Scotia screaming with horror. Nova Scotia. You said the little mushroom people. <laughs> and, and, I, and, and remember, right now, this is this is not Canada tradition either. This right. is not tradition. <laughs> Prince is attempting to grab hold of the cube. This is indeed a horrible day for all of Canada. And, what? and the pudding has just been knocked over. Oh, this does not go with tradition at all. The royal pudding now spilling all over the abbey as the princess is lifted up, up. And away. And she's gone. The princess has been taken. <laughs> this is indeed a horrible day for Canada, and therefore the rest of the world. <laughs> <laughs> this little baby, though. All right, boys, prepare yourself. <laughs> We're about to enter French Canada. French Canada? What? There's no Canada like French Canada. It's the best Canada in the land. The other Canada is hardly Canada. If you lived here for a day, you'd understand. <laughs> Welcome to French Canada. We have everything a heart could desire. Trapezes, trampolines, and lots and lots of cheese. Would you like a moustache? <laughs> just stay calm, boys. French Canadians are a little odd. Uh, we're just passing through to see the new prime minister. French Canadians are a, a little, little odd. odd. <laughs> <laughs> now we're breaking it down to, to, to uh, a sub-genre of right. Canadians. French okay? Canadians. <laughs> oh, gosh. Right. Y'all. French Canadians are a little odd. Uh, we're just passing through to see the new prime minister. Well, first, you must answer that phone. Ring, 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 ring. 
we don't have time for this. You cannot pass through French Canada unless you take that phone call. Ring, 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 ring. Hello? Hello! If you are going to see the new Prime Minister, then I want to go with you. He has passed a new law forbidding us French Canadians to drink wine. How can the French not drink wine? Travesty! Okay, you can come with us. Oh, very good! Let us make haste! <laughs> Newfoundland. 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 <laughs> Newfoundland. Yeah. <laughs> we know about that. So that's where we at now. <laughs> oh. Oh no. It's Scott. What are you two doing helping these Americans? Don't you know America thinks it owns Canada along with the rest of the world? <laughs> you're a dick, Scott. You're a dick. And by helping Americans, you're just as smelly as they are. Now I'm going to get you. <laughs> Not so fast, Scott. Who the hell are you? I'm Steve the Newfoundlander, and you're a Newfoundland property now. Get off before I have you arrested. Oh, this isn't over. Not by a long shot. I'll fix you. I'll fix all of you. I'll fix oh, all of you. close call. Thank you, kind Newfie. God damn it, we need to get to the new prime minister. Now! Oh, yeah, the prime minister, eh? He sure has screwed up things for Newfoundland. Life just hasn't been the same since he made sodomy illegal. Happy evening, friends. <laughs> Happy evening. Oh, wow. Yes. And we are going to learn Canadian. <sighs> With a lot of practice, you're going to find that speaking Canadian isn't so difficult. And in fact, our alphabet and yours are fairly similar. So why don't we begin singing it together? <laughs> I can't get over what like is voice? the whole head moving. That's the that, thing. It's just throwing me for that a loop. And then the voice, too. <laughs> it is just crazy. Yeah. A, B, this is good. E, e, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, B, D, Q, R, S, T, U, F, W, N, W, X, A, and these are Canadian ABCs. Susie likes hairy balls. What do you think of these? <laughs> All right, now everyone. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. As you've probably noticed, our government has decided to let anyone who wants to <laughs> cross the border and screw up our country. And they just keep coming, crossing the border with their dirty families. Wait, so so do they not say G? They say Ga? Ga, they'll go to Ga again. Yeah. You're not my buddy. Gah. Hey, Joe, buddy. You ain't my gay. <laughs> like, you but are they saying guy or gay? Sound like gay. That's what it sound like to me, too. Y'all let us know. Is it gay? Yeah. Or is it guy? Are they saying guy? They sound like gay, yeah. Because they won't say G. Like, so ah. it sounds like he's saying gay. Mm -hmm. Like, that's what it, that's <laughs> the what way it they pronounce like. the G is gay. Okay. No, is that right? Like As you've probably noticed, our government has decided to let anyone who wants to cross the border and screw up our country. And they just keep coming, crossing the border with their dirty families, playing their stupid music. I mean, look at them. I'll bet not one of them is here legally. Another moose head, eh? We should have put up a goddamn wall. <laughs> huh? The wall. <laughs> the wall again. Uh, they should have, he said they should have put up a wall. No, man. They should, now they should have put a, put a wall to keep us out. Yeah. No, he said we should have put up a wall. Canadians should have put up a wall to No, that's an American talking. He said we should have put up oh, a wall. Oh, for the Canadians. Yeah. They're walking around. Yeah, because they're coming over. We should have put up oh, a they got on wall. Because they got on the shirt. Huh? There we go. Who can tell me why Rome fell to shit? No, somebody who matters. The Roman Empire body was facing a several issues, Gary, as it reached a new millennium plan that had to... speak in English! And that's it! Why don't you Canucks go back where you came from? <laughs> wow. Slave You really think you can refer to an undocumented immigrant as a Canuck? Because when they said that this was the land of the free, I'm pretty sure that they were referring to me. And my country's gone! Now, I might not they understand are... politics, or immigration policies, or the law. But damn it, I understand there's a bunch of Canadians here and I'm gonna do something about it. We are French and British explorers, seeking furs and goods. Yeah, and I'm Dan Rather, and I got news for you. Nobody wants you here. Oh. Support is growing for a Colorado man who claims <laughs> the way to deal with illegal immigrants is to f them all to death. Yes, f them all to death. Let's make this country great again. USA! And then after we f every last one of them to death, we build a big wall. What do you mean <laughs> they built a wall? Look at his face. They built a f***ing wall. Oh, f*** them to death. <laughs> oh, oh. 
government about that. Yeah, no, sorry. Everything past here is ours. You can't, you can't go past, past here. <laughs> We're Americans. He's, we don't even. He said, you can't, you can't go past here. Okay. <laughs> pa past here. Okay. <laughs> That's a hell of a wall too. <laughs> oh, don't come over to my wall. You mean my wall? Yeah. We got our wall up already <laughs> now. Now we got our wall up. You can't come over here. Past here is ours. You can't, you can't go past, past here. <laughs> we're Americans. We don't even want to be over there. What do you think we're going to do? Well, you know, we just don't want you raping our women and stuff. That is ridiculous. All right, smart ass. That's just about Look, enough. just some really cool shit back here, and we don't feel like sharing it. <laughs> cool shit like what? Don't worry about it. No, oh, what's back there? Let me see. It's all right, Karen. No, goddammit, let me see. <laughs> oh, my God. Mr. President, you need to do something about your millennials. What do you want me to do? Parents and Philip are Canada's largest export. Wait, that's Trump. <laughs> what is he his, doing? Is he doing? Plucking his eyebrows. <laughs> he looking in the mirror, plucking his eyebrow, tweezing, look, 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 look. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want me to do? What do you want me to do? Parents and Philip are Canada's largest export. They account for eighty percent of our gross national product. If your citizens mess with them, they mess with all of us. Look, I'm president of the United States. I can't get involved in every petty little protest against a third world country. Third world country? How dare you? Canada's second world at least. Now you listen here, Mr. Buddy. Either you stop the embargo on the Terrence and Phillips show, or we'll bring in our own troops to stop it ourselves. Are you threatening us, you beady-eyed Canuck? I'm simply telling you that Canada will do what it must to protect itself. Then I guess both our countries better be prepared. Yes, this is Millennials Against Canada. Yeah, listen, this thing's kind of escalating. You people need to call it quits. We can't do that, Mr. President. Someone has to do what's right. What exactly do you want? What do I want? I want a world where laughter doesn't come at someone else's expense. Where people can live freely without fear of being farted on. <laughs> I want a world where you aren't ridiculed for trying to help. A world where a nice girl that I liked isn't turned into another Eric Cartman. These Canadians are in the way of that world, and everything they do and everything they have done <laughs> needs to be erased from the earth. Jeez, I got a little chub. For the world, oh. <laughs> <laughs> the no. We'll take the world together. We'll take you by the no. hand. No, he did it. Philip? 
She makes me so mad sometimes. Catherine just won't stop craving, but I don't know if I can live without her. <laughs> no, man! <laughs> hey, I'm sorry. I was wrong. <laughs> Did you catch that? Oh, no. oh my god, the best no. for last. No, I cannot. <laughs> look at the G, look at the G string. <laughs> look at the Canada, the Maple Leaf. <laughs> Yo, okay, y'all. <laughs> Katie, I'm sorry. I was wrong. <laughs> I don't love your quips, but damn it, I love you. Oh, Terrence. Philip. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> no, I cannot, I cannot say Kelly. <laughs> yeah. I cannot, y'all. Like, okay, like, I was not, I didn't know. Look, I didn't even oh know gosh. what to expect, but that was so, oh my gosh. Oh. Y'all, the way that they put the Canadians, poor Canadians, I just feel like, <laughs> I just make them look so hated, y'all. I can't breathe. I don't even think, like, no, there's no way. There's this, obviously, this is humor. That's there's not the no real way, relationship. There's no way that Americans hate Canadians. Yeah, like that's, that. not, that's not the real relationship. Absolutely not. But, but, but I you love. You can't come past this area. Yeah. <laughs> like this, over here, okay? Like that. But I like the panda. I like the panda going back and forth. I do up. too. It's, oh it's super my gosh. hilarious. That was so funny. Oh my goodness. Because like, you know how sometimes back in the day you was like Canada you didn't really know if Canada was a country or not. You know what I mean? Like when you was younger. Like when they used to talk about like Canada and bring up like Canada and, and like the United States. Like when I was younger, I used to think they were like all oh, one. I never thought that. No. No. No, when it, when it, when it <laughs> would be like North America and they had it like all together, it's like I might have been like second, third. Grade, but I never like thought that. Canada was a part of the United yeah, States. I, yeah. ne I never thought that. I did. Like, I did like a long time ago. Like like when I used to see it like on the globe and I used to see it all together. I used to thought that, I used to oh, think gosh. that it was like all together. So it was kind of ironic when they were kind of bringing up this whole thing that you're not even really a country. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. So I so I I, I like the pandering back and forth because that <laughs> this was like the most epic of all time in regards to like. Versus somebody like oh man, that was so funny. <laughs> like almost like a Canada versus like the U.S. type of like yeah like, like jab back and forth. Yeah, y'all. Yeah, this this is... was good. Yeah, it was. It was. It was, it was so on good. point. And they had that's crazy because they had some of the the main characters <laughs> like their their voices as the Canadian voices. Right. So it's funny to listen to them do that. But I can like the the head talking the whole head. <laughs> is talking y'all i'm just like y'all the way that they even made the characters i just feel like they just was like that's a little that has something to do with it too in regards to just like <laughs> the, like, like the comedy of it how, how, what makes it so hilarious is that especially at the very very end yeah but, oh my but, gosh yeah but I, I like how they were like dropping all these different quotables in regards to just like canada and and, and, and really you walk away with like understanding like some of that like like, like, like the lingo and the language and like the terms and things of that nature that they yeah. say out of this, even though it's, it's so quirky, it's so <clears throat> over the top, it's so hilarious and funny, it's like you still kind of learned a little bit about Canada to yeah. a degree. Yeah, queefy. Yeah. Queefing. You de Queef. we, we, we definitely learned, <laughs> what? We what definitely learned what is not traditional yeah. in Canada. Yeah, we did. But that was funny. That was, This was, was so, so funny. It's, it's like I could take so many different spots and be like, <laughs> this was good, this was great, but it, all of it was really, really good. Yeah, it was. It was. It was good. <laughs> so, hey, if y'all enjoyed this video, be sure you give us a big thumbs up, like, yeah, comment, man. and subscribe. Smash that notification bell so you don't miss any videos from Asia and BJ. And if ain't nobody else told you, yeah. I love you. And we're going to see y'all in the next video, y'all. Y'all be blessed, man. Appreciate y'all yeah. for tuning in. Yeah. Bye.